So we're back with more Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon, and uh, I'm actually, I had to get back to where I was, but I did it on PC this time. So the rest of this series will be on PC. I just love the controls a lot more. So, we'll see how it goes. What's up with all the blue goo? Oh, oh shit! shit. Is that a dinosaur? What the fuck is that? <gasps> You've got to be kidding. Dr. Darling mentioned they possess poor eyesight. Crouching may be advisable. The creature is emitting bioradiation. I've calibrated your scanner to alert you to their presence. Leave the cave, so as long as I crouch, I'm okay. This game is so loud. I have my speakers all the way up, so. So I must say that this is really surprising. Uh, I thought they did a fantastic job with this little standalone expansion. Oh shit. So, I don't have a strong enough computer to run Far Cry 3, but. Just about anybody's computer should be able to run this since it's standalone. You don't need Far Cry 3 to play it. Uh, I can run this at like 100%, so that's what I'm doing for you today. I'm still going to keep it 720p, though. Damn it. What now? Detecting heightened olfactory capabilities. Throwing cyber hearts may lure the dragon away. Throw cyber hearts, so oh, no. You've got to be kidding. Time to put your hearts into it. <laughs> yeah. All right, here it goes. Fetch. Go get it. Go get it. Objective. Move to the designated vantage point. I recommend collecting more cyber hearts. You don't say. Oh yeah, I want to say thank you for all the likes and support on the first part. Uh, really surprised how well it did. And I thank you for that. I just like the way this game is set up. So I'm going to definitely have a lot of this for you. And uh, it, it's just a game that overall I think they did a fantastic job. It probably shouldn't exist. Because of how goofy it is. But for what it is, though, it, they did a fantastic job, so. There's some more cyber hearts right there. I'm scared to stand up. Oh, shit. Just remember, the shield protects the soldiers inside from the dragons. But it won't stop the dragon's laser fusion blasts. They're what? Hello? Pimp. Reminder. Throw a cyber heart at the markers I've indicated. So basically, I get them to go inside there. Okay. Here we go. Go, go. Is this where shit's about to hit the fan? <gasps> yes. There was another one up top Holy somewhere. Shit. Omega Four soldiers just arrived. I'm not supposed to be here. Oh no, they're rounding up the scientists. Then get out. Not if you want a shot at Sloan. You need to secure the garrisons for supplies. Detecting weapons in the bunker that you can use. Am I safe if I stand up now? I'm scared of how how far these things can can reach. Okay, we're good. Objective. Use cyborg vision to tag hostiles in the base from the overlook. This is really well done. I like this. Okay, we're not going to do that just yet. So overall, it's, it's handling pretty well on my computer. I was kind of worried about that. Here we go. Oh, 
All right, so the method of attack I think I'm gonna use, I'm gonna shut down the shields first, or at least try to. We'll see how that goes. And then I'll lure, lure in the, uh, I'm gonna call them dinosaurs for now. I really don't care. Oh shit, here they come. The hell with this? Someplace safe. I am. This is going to get bloody and messy fast. Those happen to be my two favorite things. You want to go The one up top, I could probably get him. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, this game just feels a lot better on a. Uh, a different thing that like, I play the entire Far Cry 3 game on 360 and then some on PC. Here's a shut shut that shit down right there. I don't know if they can come all the way around like that. What to find out, I guess. Oh shit. What the hell is all this? Oh my god. Reminder, you can use cyber hearts to lure the dragon out of the garrison. So now I have to kill the dragon. That's going to be a problem. Let me look around and see if there's any other guns I can pick up. I don't think there is cuz they usually they'll strip everything away and then What a Oh wait, is that That's not a gun. Is it? Yes it is. Are you kidding? Where's my bow? <laughs> Take it out of people. Damn, he's tearing everybody up. The dragon. I'm scared to go near the other people. I'm not gonna do it. What I'm gonna do instead is run this way. So I was gonna make this series uh, just strictly on one system, but I figured one also like showing you a variety of graphics. He can't get up here, can he? If I can get him weak, we'll be fine. I just don't want to get near that. I'm really worried he could get up here. Holy shit. He's, he's still got more than half life left. That's what's sick. So it's beneficial to do this, but at the same time... So now I, I... I put him back out and then... I mash the button. Let's try this again. Snack time. Please work. Please work. Mega shields. Ah, shit. No, no, no. No, no, no. What are you doing? What the hell? To be over, Sergeant. I think it's time we meet. Send me your location, and I'm on my way. Coordinates received. Objective. Rendezvous with Dr. Elizabeth Darling. These scientists, guys, have they don't stand a chance. I'm not going anywhere yet. This fool's got to get outside. One more time. Go get him, boy. If I can lure him out there, that'll give me enough time. You don't even really have to do anything else. I like that. Objective complete. Are you okay? Yes, thank you. What are those things? We're not sure. Perhaps a living fossil from the early Cretaceous period. We call them blood dragons. BDs for short. When Sloan drank their blood, it supercharged his cybernetics. He drank their blood? Is that a joke? No, Sergeant. 
If it is a joke, I'm afraid it's a bad one. The blood supercharged Sloan, making him even more powerful. And one ugly motherfucker. Why are you helping Sloan? And what does he want with that rocket? Sergeant, slow down, please. We were using the rockets to test biochemical payloads of the dragon's blood. Rockets? As in more red spears? How many? I don't know. A lot. I don't think Sloan is interested in tests anymore. And I don't even want to get into what it does to normal people. That's why you went AWOL? Sergeant, Sloan wasn't entirely there to begin with. Now he has the rockets, and God knows what he's planning. What's with the needle, Doc? Listen, this will make you more like Sloan. Powerful, but without the side effects. No, Doc. No way. I swore an oath to a special lady. Your wife? No. Lady Liberty. She taught me that winners don't use drugs. All right, look. Sloan runs three top secret facilities, each critical to his operations. I'm sending you their coordinates. Contact me when you reach them, and I'll give you all the intel you need. You got yourself a deal, Doc. What about you? Are you safe here? Just as long as Sloan doesn't realize I'm helping you. Good luck.